Hey everyone, it's me, Arthur K. It's Hannah Davis. Last time I saw you, you were playing tennis outside with Rafael Nadal. Yeah. And here we are, Sports Illustrated. You were on the cover last year. Do you miss being on the cover? Do you want to take it from no, me? It's, it's, <laughs> no, to be honest, it was such a good time, but it's like time to pass the torch, you know? And it's going to be such a wild and crazy year for these girls that I'm so excited to see this uh, really transform their life. So it should be interesting. What was being on the cover? How did it change your life? Oh my God, it, it just changed it in so many ways from the littlest things, from being invited to events and being taken seriously in the fashion world to hosting a TV show. It just kind of, it's a wild, wild ride, but it's been a blast. So, and to be asked back again, it's just, you know, and to see these girls. And it's like an automatic invite. If you're on the cover, you're definitely yeah, gonna. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I said this in one of the videos on SI.com and I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I said that. But it's so true because every year you wait for a callback. I mean, it's not a guarantee that once you're in the issue, it doesn't mean you, ha you get to come back. So for me, I was like, yes, this means like, I get to be in it another year. <laughs> When yeah. you look at what MJ and the magazine did this year with Ashley, Rhonda, Haley, really the all-encompassing body type, yeah. I think it's got to be so great. What do you think being part of a brand that's forward-thinking like that? I think it's amazing and it's, it's definitely sort of iconic and, and kind of major for them to do this because there's never been three covers and to take three girls that have very different body types just totally different looks and put them on covers so then the fans can get a little bit of something different you know they can find themselves in each of the girls or one of them or you know so I think it's it's a it's a pretty cool thing congratulations are in order for you by the way congratulations uh, on your you. personal life exciting change busy year for you ahead yes definitely <laughs> <laughs> is it like are you like oh my god I'm getting married crazy no I don't know if it's really set in I mean maybe that'll change once I'm married but for now it's you know, I've got so much, so many things coming up that it's kind of a blur. <laughs> Project Runway, you're having fun. It seems like it's been a blast for you. Yeah, no, Project Runway Junior was um, just such a blessing because I got to work with kids, and that's always sort of been a passion of mine. Um, growing up, I wanted to be a special ed teacher, and my sister became one. And um, so it was really great to work with kids on the show, and I think that that's what sort of made my year after Sports Illustrated. By the way, these kids, they're ridiculously talented. I it's know. like, do you sit there and you're like, it is unfair for like a 12 year old to be as talented as this I, person? I know, and you know what? There is one of the girls actually learned to sew on YouTube. Unbelievable. Self-taught, these kids are amazing. Swim City, I love the fan reaction. Yeah. What's been the one or two coolest fan reactions you've gotten so oh far? Oh my gosh, I don't know. I think it's just amazing that they all come out and they just wait here all day to get a signature. I'm like, for for us? This is awesome. Um, but yeah, I think the meet and greets and taking pictures with the fans and and the, the Snapchats and the Instagram, whatever, I'm learning a lot. I'm not big on social media. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm getting a lesson today. <laughs>